Hello, beautiful human beings. Welcome back to my channel. I'm Gabby, if you didn't know, now you know. Today we are, we got a lot to do. So it's Thursday and we leave for Geneva tomorrow in literally pretty much exactly 24 hours and I've done nothing to prepare. That's not true, I did one step to prepare. I made a packing list and look how cute this is. I'm very proud of this. Look at that. It probably took me way longer than just making a little like note in my phone, but it's so cute. So Double O's color scheme for the weekend is pink and blue. It's kind of been Double O's colors since my first year on Double O Five. I'll insert a picture right here of our team gifts at Worlds that year. Ever since then, it just stuck. So that not everything we get is black and gold. So our team gifts for the weekend were blue and pink, and it's just fun. Makes it more fun. I'll show you the team gifts later on. But it is currently Alexa. What time is it? It's 11:44 a.m. 11.44. the sunshine, Gabby. Thanks, Alexa. 11.44 a.m. I woke up this morning, took Cloud for a walk, did all my morning routine stuff, watched Big Brother while I made my packing list, and now it is time to go on some errands, get everything we need. First stop on the list is Party City because last year our theme for the weekend was Cops and Robbers, which, fun fact, that wasn't even our theme for like our routine yet. We did it for the weekend and then it turned out to be our theme. But last year I got all the girls little handcuffs as like a prop and it was just so fun. Really buddy? So this year I think there's really like the theme for camp is friends. So there's really not much I can do with that. So I think I'm just going to go get everyone like pink and blue bandanas just so it's something fun. Something fun we can wear. Double O goes all out for Geneva even though we're like the oldest team there. We have so much fun and we always are like the best dressed everything. So I'm going to go get some props. Some fun stuff that we can have for the weekend and then I have to go to Target or somewhere. I don't know where I'm gonna go to get like travel shower stuff and just other little necessity things I need. I totally forgot that last night because I got home so late, there's zero parking near my apartment. So I had to park all the way across the apartment complex. So here I am just walking by the soccer field, giving you a mini little apartment complex tour all the way to my car. Luckily, I was on FaceTime with Lexi last night or else I get terrified and feel like I'm gonna get kidnapped even though my apartment complex is very safe. I just hate walking alone at night and it is quite a far walk, so. Just had a rant for a second, but we're almost to the car now. Then we're going to Party City. I'm so excited. I love going all out for stuff like this. I have so much fun. We made it, mother truckers. Ew, that was really annoying. I'm sorry, but we made it. <laughs> we should honestly just kill two birds with one stone and I should find a Halloween costume while I'm here because I have no idea what I'm doing. I don't even know if we have plans. Like, I don't, what's, I feel like Halloween is so weird this year. 2020 is just so weird. What is even happening? Okay, anyway, made it to the back color wall. Now let's find pink and blue. We're on the hunt for bandanas, scrunchies, and honestly, whatever the heck else we can find. All right, update. Found 11 of the like teal bandanas for the girls. We have 11 girls. And I was gonna get one for everyone, but I don't even know if the guys will use them. And they're honestly way more expensive than they were online. They're three dollars, which is not much, but when you have to buy like 30 of them, adds up a little bit if they're not gonna use them. And then I found these scrunchies. Maybe like let me use those scrunchies, but I don't know if it's the exact pink, but it might be the closest we got. I don't know. We're still looking around. Let's see what we can find. Should I get everyone some tutus? A nice little boa. Ooh, these fun gloves possibilities are endless honestly that was kind of a success that went better than expected so i got all the girls these two scrunchies because we show out at geneva like girls go all out we'll do matching hair so i figured if we have two like our go-to hairstyles always like the two braids into a little pigtails we'll probably do that so that way i got everyone two so we can keep our options open do some fun hairstyles then I got all the girls these bandanas, whether we wear them as like headbands or around the neck as an accessory, around the leg, whatever we're feeling, spice up an outfit, super cute. Then I got, so the cafeteria food is not, I haven't had it in probably like four years. I think my first year at Geneva was the only year I ate the cafeteria food. So we always get, I'm gonna get like an electric tea kettle to bring. Normally I bring a microwave, but that is excessive for this year. It's only a two day thing. So I'm just gonna get like an electric tea kettle that heats up water so that way we can make Easy Mac, ramen, stuff like that just right in our room. And then the girls always have a pizza night one of the nights. So I got paper plates, of course, in the cute color scheme. And then just some napkins and silverware. So cute. And my thought process was, it'll match my house if we don't use it all so I can bring it home. So. 
I wanted to find like sweatbands or something because I, I always feel like that's so cute to wear around the leg, but they didn't have any of those. And then I walked into Dollar Tree to see if they had anything and I walked like right out, there was nothing in there. So it's 12.25 right now, I need to go. I don't necessarily want to go all the way to Target, but I feel like that's my best bet of everything that they'll have, which it's only 10 minutes away from where I'm at right now. So, I think we're gonna go to Target. I'm gonna get the electric tea kettle. I need like travel shower stuff and just like my travel little toiletries, that's the word, for some reason. <laughs> for some reason, lingerie was gonna come out of my mouth. I don't know how I got that out of toiletries, no clue. That is not what I meant. I meant toiletries. <laughs> like, yeah, just a whole bunch of travel stuff and then some snacks some water, stuff for the cabin for the weekend, and see if they have anything else fun there. So, let's go to Target. Why am I tempted to buy this? We did it. Wow, this hair. But you know I'm stressed that I don't have enough time to get everything done. When I pass up Starbucks, was gonna get it and I was like, nope, I'd rather just get home. That's weird, I don't ever do that. But I'll do a little haul of everything when I get home. I just wanna get home. How many times can I say the word home? Um, yeah, so it's 1.15 right now. We are making pretty good time. I don't think I have to be at the gym until 5.45 today. So that gives me an extra like 40 minutes than normal because I don't think I have to help with baby jags anymore because Lexi is finally back in the gym. Oh, I miss her so much, I'm so happy. But let's get home. Why the heck the lighting so bad? I'm home. I just struggled so bad with carrying all those bags up my multiple flights of stairs. But we made it, so we'll do a little mini Target haul. So, my electric tea kettle to warm up water. Then along with that, we got some Easy Mac, some instant ramen, always the chicken flavor, some applesauce, and some Sour Patch Kids. Then I got two bags of cheddar jalapeno Cheetos, and then I just have a case of water in here. Nothing fancy there. I don't know where to put this stuff right now. Then I just got some vitamin waters. These are my absolute favorite flavor. Acai, blueberry, pomegranate. So good. And then last, I just got a bunch of travel stuff that I need. So I have shampoo, conditioner, body wash, um, is this not so cute? It's so like minimal. It's like my little muted Tiffany blue color and I love it as like decoration. And like actually using it as a toothbrush. Toothbrush, but I thought it was so cute. It was like 99 cents, so I got it. Not even for this weekend, I just wanted that. Um, travel toothbrush and toothpaste. Hair ties. Little rubber bands for if we do cute um, braided hairstyles and dry shampoo, and that is everything. So those are my little camp necessities. Um, um, yeah, so it's 1.42 right now. I'm probably gonna make lunch. I'm not gonna pack or anything right now. I'm gonna focus on getting my video edited and done and sent into a brand ASAP. So, these are the team gifts that we got this year for Geneva. Um, I don't know where to set you. So this is our practice outfit that we got for this year, but um, they made it wrong and these straps literally sit like on your esophagus and you can't breathe so we're getting new ones so we're not wearing those this weekend but that is our new practice outfit i'm pretty sure it's like for last year's theme because it definitely looks like our cop uniform which is not our theme this year but oh well they're just black and nice okay so here's our camp geneva shirt for this year normally it's white and normally we do color wars but obviously that's not sanitary so this year it's covid wars and we're just gonna wear this Super cute, super fun. Then, look how cute this sports bra is. So like I said, our color scheme for the weekend is just pink and blue. So we have this blue sports bra with pink rhinestone double O and the back is so strappy and cute. You'll see all of this in my Camp Geneva vlog, obviously when I'm wearing it, but I thought it was so cute, so I had to share. And then this hot pink tank that says double O and rhinestones and then Top Gun, so cute, so fun, love it. Let's see, what else? Everything came in this cute little bag. My favorite color. We got a custom mask, because obviously we're gonna have to wear one all weekend, and this just goes over your ears. Does that. 
I'm gonna stop vlogging for right now because there's nothing fun to show and nothing I'm doing to prepare. Little things I wanna do, I need to shower in the morning, probably straighten my hair before we leave maybe. I wanna do my eyebrows, shave my legs, just get everything ready for the weekend so I don't have anything to worry about when I'm there. And that's the plan. How are you doing, little man? So cute. Okay, see you later. Hello. It's a lot later. Currently 1027, and I'm just now getting ready to pack. I'm so tired. I'm so stressed. But great news, my video was edited, sent in, and already approved, so I don't have to worry about having to do any work or make any edits this weekend. Thank God. You should see my outfit right now. I literally don't even match. But got home from the gym, immediately podcasted, made dinner, and I'm just now getting done with that. So I'm gonna show you the gifts Cat4 got, and oh, I love coaching them. Seriously, like the best thing ever. So here's our cute little bag. We got the Cat4. It says Coach Gabby. It's my first thing that says Coach Gabby. A nice, fun little Cat4 tank top. So cute. Look how cute this mask is. Says Coach Gabby, why are you not focusing, camera? Says Coach Gabby, in the Cat 4, it's like not showing up, but it's that like reflective material. So when you take a picture and flash, it like does that thing. So fun. Their color scheme for the weekend is navy blue. So they have a navy blue scrunchie and navy blue Cat 4 sweatband. And I think these might be my absolute favorite. How fun are these? So fun, so fun. But I am sad because I'm not gonna be with them a lot this weekend because the way Geneva works is we go through our stations and you get coached by other coaches. So already I wouldn't have been with them, but I'm also there with Double O and I have to be an athlete on Double O. Like the whole weekend is stunting, it's no tumbling. So it's literally everything I'm in. So I'm gonna be with Double O most of the weekend. So unfortunately I don't get to be with Cat 4, but also Geneva is like one of my favorite weekends as an athlete, so I'm so excited. So the plan is for everything to fit in my little carry-on suitcase. Now I do have a suitcase bigger than this, but the cabins are very big, so I don't want to bring a huge suitcase and then have a ton of room taken up with it. And also, I'm there two and a half days. We leave Friday, we have camp Saturday, we have camp during the day Sunday, we have a staff dinner and staff social Sunday night, and I leave Monday morning. I'm gonna be in practice clothes pretty much the whole time. So I, need, I, I can pack light, but I'm seriously, the world's worst packer, hands down. I designate that to myself. I'm so bad at it for some reason. It takes me forever, it stresses me out, and I overpack like crazy. So we're gonna try not to do that. Well, update. I don't think I can fit everything in this suitcase. And I think it'd be better, instead of trying to squeeze it in, to have a bigger suitcase and pack more of my snacks and stuff in my suitcase so I have less bags to bring. I think that'd be better. So we're gonna ditch the small suitcase, go to the big one, and not stress about it. It's now 11.07 and I'm not done. We love that. Why do I hate packing so much? Also, I, like I said, I'm there two days and I'm gonna be in practice office the whole time. Why am I packing this much? Listen, we're just gonna have to deal with this. I don't feel like fixing it. It is now 11.58 PM. <laughs> when did I start this? 10 something? Literally like an hour and a half ago, but we did it. She is all packed. It's amazing. Why do I pack so much? Anyway, proud of myself because I use my little packing cubes. So it's nice and organized, which I think is going to help me a lot with camp. Even though my suitcase is bigger, I feel like everything is more organized. So it should go well. Brought the tripod. We can take some TikToks. What's wrong, buddy? He's been laying in his bed and it's really cute. Um, I'm all packed up. I'm just going to add this into this suitcase so I don't have to bring like seven grocery bags as well. And we got to pack that up. This is mainly packed. This just has like my cheer shoes, some snacks, all my scrunchies. I'm going to put my iPad in here tomorrow and all my chargers. I will update you guys in the morning. I'm going to go to bed. Good night. See you tomorrow. I'll look a little bit better than this because I'm going to shower as soon as I wake up. <laughs> Good morning. It is the next day. I am fresh out of the shower as you can see. And I'm about to order Starbucks, take this one for a walk, finish packing everything up. I really need to do my eyebrows. They're really bad. Also, my skin is kind of breaking out right now, which not cool, dude, but I need to do my eyebrows. And then I was going to straighten my hair, but I don't even know if my hair will be dry in time. And I have to film a sponsorship before I leave. And I have two hours to do everything. So it's crunch time, baby. Let's get to it. 
and we're back. Can you tell a difference? Eyebrows are done, cleaned up a little bit, and Starbase is here. I hope you enjoyed this video. Welcome back to some cheer content. Give it a big like, comment down below, subscribe to your post notifications on, all that. Lots of cheer content coming, so get ready for it, and I'll see you in the next video.